Oh, I don't know. <laughs> hey, landed on my feet here, haven't I? Landed on my feet. I don't think I've seen it. No, I know. I've not done a house that's been, plaster work's been done in this way. <sighs> Over 10 years, I think. Over 10 years. And uh, top it off, I can't spray. So I've got to do it all by hand. That's going to be a shock to the system this week, isn't it? I mean, I've got to prime it first with some June Lux Trade Drywall Primer or something. Never used that before either. Oh my God. Needless to say, I'm not going to do another one. I can assure you. Seems like a decent sight and everything. Uh, and if it weren't done like this, you could make some money. I'll be lucky to get this done in five days and it's only a three bed. I ended up doing it on day work, wouldn't I? So no, I don't, don't think I'll be doing another one. This will be it, the only one. And uh, top it off, I've got to travel 40 minutes just to get here. No fuel on top, even worse. No. No, there's, there's, there's other jobs and other companies you can work for. Uh, even stay on this firm, there's, it, they've got other sites. I'm not coming here again, I can assure you. Well, here's that Dulux Trade Drywall Primer Sealer. There you go. That's what it is, white. Normal specifications on the back. Yeah, there you go. And I kid you not, I kid you not, I've opened two brand new 10 litre tubs, sealed, and uh, it, it's just full of bits. Completely full of bits, like dried skin. I don't even think it's dropping off the lid on the inside, it's, it's, all the way through the paint, just bits of, of skin. We're talking to one of the other lads, and they've been using it for absolutely ages, and they say every tub's like that, just full of bits. So it's not just me, is it? It's uh, obviously got a short-term shelf life or, or something. Well, that's what the lad said, actually, he said that. But yeah, full of bits, nightmare. Give me a right of day. Rolling, 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 stop. Flick it off, flick it off, flick it off. Do me heavy. Um, I shouldn't, I, I, I don't pay for it, but I should imagine it's quite expensive. Ooh, yeah, buy it up. Julux, what's going on guys? What's going on? No, drywall primer sealer, full of bits. Not good, is it? Not good. Right, here's this wall primer. I'm just going to try and show you lot how many bits is in it. Already there's some at the top of the, the, the paint, but look, you see, look at all the bits in that, look. Shit loads of stuff in there, it's garbage, isn't it? So oh, yeah, there you go. Full of bits, that is. The only thing that's good for is the bin, because I ain't got time to strain that out. Should be, should be coming uh, to the shelf perfect, actually. Brand new tub as well, that is. Brand new tub straight off the shelf. Should be ashamed of yourself, guys. Should be uh, getting it away. <laughs> Not selling it. But hey, who am I? I suppose that's why uh, Crown has um, got the symbol by Her Majesty. Mm. Tell you what, you want me on your side, not against you, <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. 
Have me on your side. Keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Well, it was inevitable, wasn't it? It just had to happen, didn't it? Oh. <laughs> Starting to thaw out a bit now, thank God. Hey, uh, my pride and joy. Yeah, fight up. No, it makes you laugh, doesn't it? You go back 15, 20 odd years painting the door. You'd just be doing it with a brush and a small little roller, wouldn't you? But nowadays, you've got your six and a half inch Worcester sleeves and a lot of guys spray them as well, don't they? Oh, just takes you back, doesn't it? How times move and if you can't adapt, improvise and overcome, you get left behind. You get left behind, don't you? I was speaking to a patient the other day and he was doing two bungalows and he done not spray. And he'd been base coated out and uh, he was struggling to cut tin because the corners hadn't been done, so we gave him an NA. But if he'd got a spray machine like I've got, that great no 390 cordless, he uh, wouldn't have had any problem at all, would he? It? It'd have just take some whiz through it, but yeah, it makes you laugh, doesn't it? How times change. We've got these nice, easy, straightforward doors here. Just run a sash brush in, in these grooves. Right side. Multitude of ways you can do it, I can roll that bit now. I've just been coming on the way down in the grooves. Now I'll roll it from the bottom. Just try to eliminate the amount of times I get up and down. Don't want to overload the grooves, otherwise it's just going to be dripping. Uh, it does make it a bit more shinier. 
when you're laying off with a brush, you stand just leaving a roll and finish, but that's what everybody's doing now, just leaving it in a roll and finish. But I remember the day you rolled it, actually laying on them off, how times change, eh? How times change. That's it, another one done. But I do recommend those cordless sprayers, whether you're just doing the emulsioning or, or not. Um, I know a lad, sound lad, on this bird. Good as his job and everything. But it's just, it's just gone out and bought another sprayer with a generator because it was cheap. Which is fine, yeah, no problem with that. But them generators are not light, are they? They're ready. Normally a two-man operation to lift them out of your car or your van. And I, I, can't, I can't, even if it's a thousand quid, I, I don't know why you would have done it. Just save up the money, take a loan and get the cordless one. Absolute game changer, that is. I've, I've, I've been doing it for over a year, I think now, with that cordless one. And, and never looked back, because like, it's just something else. It really is something else. I don't have to worry about power, I don't have to worry about drip trays, I don't have to worry about petrol can, buying petrol, price of petrol going up or anything, um, and, and carrying a Jenny. don't have to worry about that. All I do, make sure the batteries are charged, run it at about 1000 psi, more than adequate, batteries last ages on 1000 compared to 1500. And I just bring it in and, and spray away. You know, I ain't got to worry about dragging a generator around or if a plot's not got any power. And if it has got power, I can just charge the batteries up for free. Happy days. So, and there's multitude of sprays now that are battery operated. You might as well get one of them. I was speaking to a Sparky not long ago. We actually bought, I mean, I've got two sixes and two 12AHs. He bought a 15 AH. I've not checked them out yet, but apparently they're like eight, nine inches long. <laughs> I can imagine that. About 300 quid he paid for it though. But yeah. Anyway, time for a cup of chart, lads. Time for a cup of rosy loo. Don't be fooled by false promises from a new employer. Take it as a pinch of salt.